Hey guys! I'm a bit new to the voiceover thing, but hopefully you'll be okay. I decided to do a redraw of Chat Blanc because while I think the design is okay, I think it could have been a lot stronger if it was more than just a color invert of Chat Noir. When I first saw it, I thought if he had the choice, how would Gabriel reimagine Chat Noir? Because he designs all the other Akumas. Gabriel has these high expectations and heavy demands of Adrian. So I think a costume change could reflect that, you know? Chat Noir's outfit is very fun, and it's supposed to represent his wild side. And I think a lot of storytelling could be done with a total change in costume. When designing this, I wanted it to look like he was being put back under Gabriel's thumb. Previously, I thought about doing some epic style design, but I figured it wouldn't fit with the show's style, though not like this does either. But also because it would take away from the unfair power dynamic if I made Chat Noir look too cool and powerful. Uh, I suppose I wanted Chat Blanc to look almost like a henchman, though whether or not that came through is up to you. I based the suit somewhat off of the one that Gabriel wears because I wanted it to kind of identify him as being under Gabriel, sort of like a uniform. Because from what I've gathered, Gabriel doesn't seem to see Adrian as much more than a tool. I mean, he's shown that he doesn't want him to get hurt physically, but he's also disregarded his safety a number of times. He's disregarded his friend's safety. There was the episode where he made his bodyguard turn into a crazy guy and carry him everywhere. And that's super, super dangerous. Not the best dad in the world, but... Jumping off that point, I really wanted it to sort of look like they were a solid, cohesive unit. When redesigning him, I kept a few things from the original, namely his color palette, his eyes, and his ears. Otherwise, I changed a few things. I gave him a face mask, not to keep him safe, but to represent what I feel like Gabriel wants from his son, which is someone who doesn't ask questions, who is quiet, and who does as he's told. The suit I've already explained, so I'll skip to his hair, which sort of looks like Felix's, I guess? But why I decided to make it look so neat is because when Adrian turns into Chat Noir, his hair gets messy, and I thought that might be a fun thing to include in his redesign. Also, I think it makes him look very sterile, like he has no personality anymore, which he sort of doesn't when he's being puppeteered by his crazy dad. So I also made him paler, just to kind of wash him out and make it look like uh, it's all one thing, sort of. I don't know how to explain it other than that. But I wanted it to make him just look even more devoid of life and feeling and purpose, kind of. <laughs> so that's pretty much it for the notes on what I changed and why I changed it. Uh, let me know what you think in the comments. Uh, if you like it, if you don't. I'm always open to hear criticism, otherwise have a great day and thanks for watching! Thank mm -hmm. you.